Jan Erik Nielsen. You are the manager of a Danish company called Solar Key International, and I think you are one of the very famous faces on solar certification, which is like a qualification, a quality scheme internationally. 30, more than 30 years of digging into standards and certification. As such, um, you have founded something really nice uh, currently, which is a global solar certification network. Can you tell us more about that? Yes, so this solar, um, uh, global solar certification network is um, an assistance to the uh, global industry to help them uh, sell their products all over the world. So the idea is to uh, have one test and one inspection report for their products and then they can use these reports around the world. So, so that means that uh, collector manufacturers use the tests they have done in one country to get a certificate in another country. This is the idea, yes. So your, what is the role of your association in this process? So the network is then facilitating this uh, concept. So we have uh, members of uh, certification bodies and test labs. So they shall fulfill certain requirements to be members and the uh, industry shall be members also to utilize the concept. And um, due to the requirements for the test lab and the certification bodies, they can um, make mutual recognition of each other's uh, test reports and inspection reports. So what is, what is the requirements to become member for a collector manufacturer? In, it's basically to pay a fee and to uh, sign uh, the, the working rules of the network. And the fee is not that much. It's only 125 euros per year. So can you quantify that? I mean, is it really something expensive to do testing of collectors in different test labs? It's quite expensive. Uh, the collector test is normally uh, around maybe uh, 10,000 euros. So if you in a company have 10 or 20 different collector types, it's uh, maybe 100 or more thousand euros. So if you have to do this in, in several certification schemes, you can really save a lot of money if you have only one test report for, for, for each product. Well, and uh, which regions of the world are included in your global certification network? So the cooperation is from uh, US through Europe to Middle East, China and Australia. So these are the interested parties. It's not all fully, fully members yet. We have still to uh, treat the applications for the certification bodies and test labs. But we are hoping that within a few months we will have the, the, uh, the system running. And is this uh, available for flat plate or for the different types of collectors, also concentrating collectors? So it's available for all collectors which are within the scope of the ISO 9806 standard for collector testing. And this is flat plate, evacuated tubes, concentrating collectors and also uncovered collectors. And where do you find more information about this network if you want to become a member? So we have a website which is gscn.solar and uh, here you will see all information. You can uh, also go to the menu members and there's a become member site and you can just download uh, the material there. Okay, thank you and good luck. Yeah, thanks to you. I will just uh, say to the end that uh, the work is supported by the IEA solar heating and cooling program and uh, thanks for that.